So, here I sit in a hotel room. REI really dropped the ball on this. I mean, they sent me the wrong shoes, tore up my feet, told me they were going to be here like five days ago, six, whatever it is. Good on Tuesday. Am I ever going to get my new shoes? I don't know. So, I'm telling you right now, everybody, hikers, campers, whatever you want to do, REI sucks balls. I'm sorry. F my language. I'm so pissed off. I'm paying almost $100 a night to wait for shoes. I'm tired. My feet hurt. I'm feeling better now, but come on. I just want my effing shoes. Come on, please. So, I know I'm probably going to piss a lot of people off this, but REI. I'm sorry. I pissed. No, so. I'm in, obviously I'm in bed. Tired. Cranky. Old. Is what it is. But she's really REI. And then still gonna give me crap. And not get my stuff here. Come on. Going on like. 10 days then? 9 days? How long does it take shoes to get from Seattle to NorCal? Come on. But anyways, I'm sorry. I'm pissed off. I'm ranting. I'm, like you said. Sorry, guys. We'll talk to you guys in the morning. Jelly Bean. Hoping on shoes. Day 120. I'm still in Aetna. Still waiting on shoes. Y'all know how exactly happy I am about this? Not at all. So, yep. Still in Aetna. Still hanging out. Gonna go get breakfast. It's like 7.30. Yeah, pretty much. So, yeah, still here. Alright, guys. Shoes showed up, finally. Thank gosh. Of course. I already paid for tonight because didn't know if they were going to show up. And there's only 10 rooms in Aetna. So, didn't want to be in a parking lot. So, going to be here tonight. Getting back on trail in the morning. Going to relax today. Just hang out. So, alright guys. That's the update on the shoes. Happy they're here. Guys, all these lovely stinky ass hikers are heading out. With Mr. Kevin, we've already talked to him, lovely trail angel. They packed the car and they're getting right at trail. I did get my shoes, but I already paid for the hotel, so unfortunately I have to stay here one more day and just relax. So this is what it is. So hey, we'll see these guys down trail and hey, hopefully you guys will too. Hey guys, so I don't know if you can see this, but if you look around, you should be able to see mountains. And you really can't. I don't know if you can see anything in, in the video. There's one you can see an outline of. But there's a fire pretty close to here. And literally, you almost can't see anything. Uh, smoke is even heavy just across the darn parking lot. And the parking lot's only, I don't know, 50 foot wide. So, yeah. Lots of smoke. That fire's close. South, south, south west, of, west of us. But it's... Uh, Got to be getting closer. A lot of smoke. I mean, earlier you could see mountains and all over the place. Now there's like the outline of one. That's all you see. So, yeah, we're in Etna. Smoky as it is, we're in Etna. All right, guys. Right, guys so still in Edna yeah I understand um, if you do come to Edna do not go to the Pace Steak Brewery I think it's called horrible service 
literally we sat in there like for an hour and a half finally the one lady says hey can we order food the guy comes like oh really can i help you we've been there for and there's 13 people in the whole place it's like come on really so yeah so i said you know what can i just pay for my one beverage and i'm out here let everybody else have a good time maybe they'll be nicer I don't know, but I tell you, they definitely do not care about business there. That's all I'm saying. So, I'm going to go to the grocery store and get a hot bucket. For like two bucks, it's probably better than the food was anyway. So, this is what it is. That's where I'm heading. To the grocery store. Shall I be on the hunt? Alright guys, so. I'm kind of just laying down relaxing. Tired. Sick of BS. Let me tell you one thing. When you kind of get rid of people because if they're doing wrong things, they shouldn't keep trying to be around you. And I mean, really, trying to get in your room, trying to hang out, you know, trying to get stuff for free. There's a point, you know, I know I didn't say a lot of things that were going on, but come on, be a human, be an individual, understand people's rights. Anyways, I'm going to let it go there. Other words, I'll get on a rant. And I'm in a really pissy off mood. Just because that, a couple other things, and, you know, things going on. So anyways, like I said, I finally got my shoes this morning. I had already paid for the hotel room. I'm um, going to be leaving tomorrow and getting back, back on trail. Right now, I'm in such a bad mood just because the BS of with the people I used to hike around. That I don't want to be around anymore because they're, you know, not doing the right things. So, I'm sorry I'm being an ass. It is what it is. I'm pissed off. And I'm telling y'all, you know, this is what happens on trail. It's real life, you know. It's not all unicorns and roses and, you know. So, it is what it is. Hey. Right? You guys have a great night. Uh, probably going to hang out for a little while. I'm not really tired. I'm tired, but not ready to go to sleep. There's no way I can sleep. I'm too upset about stuff that's been going on. So, you know, maybe I'm going to get to the point. I just have to put it out there. But I hate to. I really do. So, I don't know. If uh, I run into that person one more time and things like Last night happened again, which I haven't told you about yet. I probably would just come out and say it. I don't know. I still may do it tonight. I'm just in that bit of a mood, so. I don't know. It is what it is. So I'm going to relax. I'm watching a little TV, a little Hallmark channel. I always get you a little better, better mood. So, sorry, can't see my eyes. But, like I said, I'm just pissed off, ornery, and not happy, and Shit goes on every day. So, this is what it is. So, all right, I'll let you guys go. I'll try to get in a better mood, and we will talk to you again before you sleep. All right, Jelly Bean just pissed off.